Easy. All right. Hello. How long are you practicing? Oh, okay. Oh. Damn, one legged and a kick. Dude. But to me, Man. this don't this don't mean to me unless you my waiter. And then I'm like, damn, <laughs> fam, that's, <laughs> that's crazy. You're about to get a tip. <laughs> Welcome back to ridiculous this. Okay, I have an unusual talent. Um, I can get my eyeballs to shake extraordinarily fast. Okay. What? Yeah. Shake? Yeah. Like what? What do you mean? Like they just go. I do that back and forth. Okay. Yeah, yeah. And where do you suppose I learned that? Well, you, can't you show us? You can't just say that and not show it to oh, us. Oh, it's faded with time. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean, I developed this as a child, you know what I mean? Oh, okay. And people would be trying to talk to me, and I'd just be hitting them with it, you know, and they'd be like, what, what are you doing? How are you doing that? Pretty distracted. Yeah, and I'd yeah. just be like, what? I'm not doing anything. And they forgot why I managed you. Yeah, and I feel like if I tried to do it right now, my, my brain would break. <laughs> uh, well, just like my eye-shaking gift uh, that I learned and taught myself, everybody in this category has their own unique talents that are unteachable. Take a look at Can't Teach It. Going down, I'm gonna. Oh, oh. Oh, you can teach this. Oh, how? You can pass it down. It's hereditary. Yeah. Oh, you think this is generational? Yeah, generational for yeah. sure. Pretty yeah. sure your father's somewhere like well, your mother. <laughs> oh. Okay. Oh. 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 What's up? You understand me? <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> my dad paid for this dock. I've been tying these since I was seven. <laughs> and my parents own this town. <laughs> Oh. Oh. Okay. Oh. Okay. Did we hire him, honey? <laughs> Here we go, internet. Uh oh. Doesn't look good. Oh. Damn. 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 She hates it or Damn. loves it. Oh my God. Oh, good. Somebody zoomed in. Someone really doesn't care. So <laughs> weird. Man, I, I got a guitar. Uh, he man. was tired of him getting out a girl. Man. Playing guitar. He was like, I got something for you guys. Watch this. <laughs> He's a real talent. There you have it for Can't Teach It. Okay, you know, there's a lot of people uh, that now have amazing skills from quarantine, okay? It's mainly like parents uh, of older kids, you know, they were like, you know, playing like some competition with toilet paper and you know shooting skittles into each other's mouths you know? okay did you learn anything weird during quarantine i, I got really good at juicing and You're really good at yeah. juicing i know yeah. i'm like i'm all about that juice life now i can see a whole line of west coast juices yep. what's your go-to yeah. juice like what you making out here um kale celery pineapple ginger lemon and green apple best juice ever sounds expensive God, man. <laughs> <laughs> If right. I sell it, it's gonna be expensive. Look, I thought she was gonna end it with White Claw. <laughs> <laughs> oh, bring it all the way over with a dash of White Claw. What's up? I was bored. Uh, look, Chanel might be a fabulous juicer, but everybody in here has useless quarantine skills. Take a look. Oh. Okay. Oh. Okay. Oh. I like this. And. You can tell his wife kind of runs the house. Like, this is a real man cave where everything he owns is in his one room. <laughs> <laughs> I'm doing darts, basketball. I'm doing pull-ups. Keep it down, honey. <laughs> I'm shooting hoops. Got it. OK, I guess now I'll read a book. First of all, it's a ghost that lives with you. Oh. You still don't have a girlfriend. You're still single. Way after quarantine. <laughs> Way out the quarantine. Okay, guys, quick cheese wall update. Um, I'm done my first batch. Amazing. I think this was about 15 packages of cheese. Hey, wallpaper. Got me. Honestly, a third of the way across the wall. So I got to make a cheese run. Got to make a cheese run going all the way across. Bro, your wall going to smell crazy. It's going to be moldy in like two days. And, yeah, it's Actually, a... no, that craft cheese be lasting. Though. That <laughs> won't mold for like 200 years. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Oh, oh, oh. He juggling oh, and eating his oh, ain't oh, up? Oh, oh, oh. That's impressive. Is it? Look, to me, that's working out and eating right at the same time. <laughs> we'll be right back with more ridiculousness. <laughs> okay, you know, what's the wildest trick shot either of you guys have ever seen? 
the wildest trick shot. Yeah, you know, I think, you know, in the Fantasy Factory days, I remember we had that, like, that crazy, like, you know, obviously we did some pretty crazy stuff with, with the dude perfect shots or we shot it off the top of the bridge. You know, there are like normal trick shots that are amazing, but then there's things that are basically impossible. Mm -hmm. That's what this category is. Trickier shots, take a look. Hey, hey, no, what's up, bitch? Man, okay. Gotta work on that uppercut, though. Don't matter. Oh! Bam, 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 bam. <laughs> I actually made it three times, but the first two just weren't perfect. Only one bounce. Yeah, that's no better. Good. Had the disc backward like an idiot. Okay, you gave Lillette. Third time's a charm. Wait, just because the CD went in the wrong way? Like, we don't give a <laughs> Nobody cares if there's a double bounce. Here we go. Okay, impressive. That is super impressive. I don't know what you get out of this. Man, just slicing and dicing. You going around, sending you home all the way there. No way. Goodbye. We don't believe you. Goodbye. He changed the shot. He did. That he was did. an edit. You think we're stupid? Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, this is like a putt at the Masters. <laughs> <laughs> it really is. We're all watching it like, there's no way. He just wants to get it close, right? He can win it with a birdie. Oh, look at this. Look at this right here. <laughs> and that's it. He's just a good shopper. We'll be right back with more Ridiculousness. OK, so, you know, to be an Olympian, how much training do you have to do? Um, and is it in cycles? Is it in seasons? Like, how much training do you actually have to do? I'd say six hours. Okay. Two hours in the gym, four hours fencing, which is like one-on-one -on -one with my coach, sparring, which is the fun stuff, and then drills, which sucks. Yeah. Uh, and then our season's 10 months a year. OK. Yeah. And, and, and look, you know, to, to be a world champion, you got to stay committed. Mm -hmm. Got to keep the mind always sharp. Be ready for the nuance of the battle when it happens. Exactly. And this category is filled with other people that have that mentality. And they're world champions. But it's in random stuff, OK? <laughs> they are literally the one of one, their own world champions. Take a look. <laughs> Greatest person ever to put a dish in. You can do it if there's no one alive that can do dishes better than me. Next. What? <laughs> Wait, that's the full wash though he doing? That was just a hey, weird man. I don't trust like that. Honestly, there's definitely gonna be some little residue left he over. Hey, <laughs> hey, it's about speed, not about cleanliness. <laughs> oh, one of the greatest to ever do it. Oh, that's crazy. <laughs> What? See, my yeah. problem with these oh. dudes is like, I don't know which way to go down. Exactly. Like, you can <laughs> confuse me. It's Man. like, are we going down this street or I'm the other car street? Accident, would you? <laughs> yeah. I'm mean, one with no one. Slow oh, down. Oh, on. I do like, want. I want to know the moving special. Yeah. Oh, oh. Shit, oh, oh, behind the back. I just, I just need to know the number. <laughs> Coming in hot. Everybody does it, <laughs> but nobody does it like me. Crazy thing is, he doesn't even work here. No. <laughs> He's just, just coming to do He's <laughs> practicing. <laughs> man. You got man. the job, OK? <laughs> the job. Oh, man, don't forget the seats now. Stack oh. right and done. Ooh. Oh. Ooh. <laughs> hi, 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 oh, hi, hi, hi. Oh. I'm not hi, fighting hi, you, hi, man. It looks like in reverse. Hi. 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 Yeah. That's it, yeah. world champion kicker of air. We'll be right <laughs> wow. back with more ridiculousness. OK, look, you have also invented quite a few tricks, right? There's the, the Nitro Circus World's First. Um, what are some of the stuff that you have done that you invented that you're most proud of? One of the scariest ones was at Travis's, I did a triple front flip on BMX, and they kind of made the setup just so I could land that trick. So that's definitely out there. But then there's other tricks that like Travis named. It's called the Free Willy. They call it, mm. and that's because I throw the scooter, it does a front flip, and while it's doing a front flip, I do a back flip, and then it smacked me in the head, but I landed it. Man, and so nobody's ever attempted that one again? Someone did at a skate park, and, and it's so impressive, but yeah, that's one of the nice. tricks that... Was it Stanley? 
<laughs> it wasn't Stanley. Okay, man, I was gonna say, man. If me and Stanley are just riding a wave of innovation, it's gonna feel good, you know what I mean? For sure. Well, look, the beauty of, like, action sports, when you do it for the first time, it's like, it truly is yours. You yeah. know what I mean? Like, action sports in general is sort of limitless by design, so it just keeps getting more innovative and more crazy over time. So I'm sure you're gonna invent a lot of stuff, just like everybody in this category, world's first. Take a look. Okay. Hey. Yeah. Oh, man. Come on through. Yeah. Da, 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 da. I wonder if he was like, watch my party trick. Yeah. Anybody that'll come through the hallway. They woke him up for this. They woke him up for this. They woke him up for this. Show him that thing you do. He's amazing. <laughs> Man, got that Malibu suction. The suction on his bald head is crazy. Man, he says, <laughs> Man, I love that all you gotta do is give him a signal. I know. Oh my God, you're a doll. Oh my God, you're a doll. <laughs> Man. God. Passing out Malibu shots, what a guy. <laughs> Let it rip. This is my future for sure. <laughs> Oh, he's playing the harmonica, whipping and spinning, and man. So what do you do for a living? Man. <laughs> it's like five things at once. Like, it's truly if Seattle was a person. <laughs> we'll be right back with more Ridiculousness. <laughs> Welcome to Ridiculousness. I'm Rob Dyrdek. With me, as always, Stilo Grimm, <laughs> you know, West Coast. OK, our guest today, singer, songwriter, producer, actor, Got a new album, Electric Dust, coming out. This is one of the most talented human beings this stage has ever seen. Welcome, the one and only Leon Thomas. Oh, thank, thank you. you. Thank you. Thank Man, thank you. I just, I mean, it is Broadway. It's, it's making music, singing music. It's acting. It's TV shows. It's movies. It's producing. You have three tracks that you produced on Certified Lover Boy. Yeah, yes, sir. You know what Pleasure, I mean? Man. Like, produce. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, thank you, thank you. I, I mean, stuff it. on Ariana Grande's album. Yeah, like, yeah, how does yeah. how does a young man end up like Broadway to the studio with Drake? How does this happen? Well, listen, you know, I come from a family of musicians, and uh, you know, music has always been a part of my life. Um, but production has definitely been, you know, the leading force so far. Uh, I really love, you know, working with a lot of the artists that I do, and you know, Ariana's actually a really good friend of mine, and, and, and working with Drake just kind of came through a lot of hard work and dedication. Yeah, no, it's, look, it's un unbelievable. Now, what do you like to do the most? You know, honestly, You man, could do all that, do you miss Broadway? I just like getting creative, man. Honestly, you know, working on, you know, music for myself has been a really good time, and I'm about to put some stuff out, so I'm, you know, pretty hyped yeah. about it, yeah. Okay, well, look, dedicated to your ability uh, to be so many different things. This first category is people doing a bunch of different things at once. Take a look at multi-hyphenated magic. Let's get into it. My man, raising really the rubbers okay. cube at the same time? <laughs> juggle in the cube, in the oh. juggle in the cube, in the juggle. Oh, man. Look, man. man. This is so cool in grammar school. Man. Who's going to high school, though? Ain't no chicks looking for you. Man. For real. Yeah. <laughs> After high school, he's gonna have money because he's gonna be smart, doing something right, yeah, and then yeah. the chicks are gonna be after him. Uh, <laughs> oh man, really shaving. No, right. Oh, he on the iPad too? Man. He's checking the mail. <laughs> no, no, he's got the mirror. I ain't gonna be using the iPad as a mirror though. This is a life. All right, there you go. Text the homies. Dad of the oh, year. Yeah. Okay. Dad, Dad of the, the year. year. Staying right. fit. Texting the homies. Yeah. Rocking the baby. <laughs> He's doing it. He's doing it. Baby's my spotter. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh, there we go. Oh, oh. Hey. Oh, I can't juggle. Oh, okay. Okay. Look, as an expert <laughs> in this field, I can tell you that's a much harder trick than just doing a, a, a shove it or a kick flip. This is the hard flip. This man is talented. The street league need like a halftime performer? <laughs> yeah, I mean, this could be. Right it could be. This is an easy call. Oh. Yeah. Here you have it for multi hyphenate magic. <laughs> okay, big in a small town, right? Like, yeah. You know, for you as like this superstar artist now, are you like beyond the legend of your small town now? I wouldn't quite say superstar, uh, uh, but <laughs> in Delaware, boy, I'm like 
Michael Jackson in Delaware. <laughs> Everywhere oh, else, man. not too much. It's... Are they gonna give you a street or something? I mean, man. They, like maybe a, a library? Man, what are I you told them I want to build a, a music center connected to my high school named after my grandma, but I did tell them, I said, yo, if y'all decide to get me a statue, can I get it while I'm alive? Like, I want to yeah. see it, bro. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, I want to take a selfie next to it, post it on the ground, yeah, even some little statue. <laughs> All right, well, look, this category is filled with, with people that are becoming legends in a small town. Oh, Take boy. a look at small town legends. <laughs> Give me something hard. I'm going to do it with a shoe off. Oh, let's go, Auntie. Keep running, please, nephew. <laughs> let's go, Auntie. Auntie go crazy. Look out. And how confident is always on the million? Man, ain't always nothing. Always on the million. Bro. Yeah! Yo. And, and left y'all ball. And got back like it's not. Look at her face, though. Look at her and face. And left y'all ball. You left my ball, auntie? Yeah, didn't matter. Don't even care. It's theirs now. I'm going. I'm taking a nap. I'm tired. I'm taking a nap. I'm tired of this. There he is, Big Mark, all the way American. Is he drunk? So he's just up there just That's jamming. it. Get it. No music, no. He is the flagpole. <laughs> <laughs> Don't do drugs, kids. Damn, I thought he was in roller skates. Oh, he going I crazy. Really, look, he was he so I've crazy. seen him on the gram before, yo. He going Damn crazy. Stop. Stop. You recognize this I've guy? I've seen him on the gram before. What? Uh. Uh, let the rat Get tail it. die. Man. His tail crazy. <laughs> Man, tail hits the ground Magical and he drops tail. back uh. up. Dang, it ain't dang. Dang, dang, dang. Yeah, he won't play and take it away. Yeah, exactly. That's how you become a legend. We'll be right back with more ridiculousness. Some people are really good at balancing stuff on their heads. Not me. At the Fantasy Factory, when you were trying to, it was like for the pageant, and you were making us walk with the books on our head. Yeah. That was when I realized I have like a very like. Round. It's it's like it's like it comes. It's almost like it comes to like a like a point here. Yeah. <laughs> like nothing balances on it at all. Yeah. That, and that's well, what yeah. If it was circle though, it wouldn't like really balance with the books either though. So you you should be happy. You don't have a flat head. Yeah. No. Yeah. I mean, look at the look at the part right there. Right? <laughs> yeah. Don't make me feel like I'm a cone head. <laughs> no, that part is like perfect. You know what I mean? <laughs> Most people just got like a wonkly wobbly head and they can't do it. But those with a flat head. They could put anything on their head and, yeah. and carry anything. Yeah. Just like everybody in this category, balancing acts. Yeah. I got a walking pointy skull. Easy. All right. Hello. How long are you practicing? Oh, OK. Wow. Damn, one legged and a kick? Dude. But to me, this don't, this don't mean for me unless you my waiter. And then I'm like, damn, <laughs> fam, that's, like, that's crazy. You're about to get a tip. <laughs> what? Wow. Oh, this is magical. Oh, oh, yeah, hey. This is magical. That's a flatty right there. That is. <laughs> and he stayed like that the whole time? Yeah, he's definitely not breathing. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, this I is... I got a full-ass person on I my mean, head, this man. is remarkable. Hey, I don't know what's going on, but I like it. I mean, this is, like... I pay for this. Man, like, best friends for life. Half time. Oh, 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 oh. oh. Oh! Hey, it's fun till it's not. We'll be right back with more ridiculousness.